Hi guys. In this video, we are going to show how to optimize your Windows 10 device for gaming and maximum performance. Follow our guide to decrease CPU load and increase CPU performance significantly by simple tricks and tweaks in power plan and by using quick CPU. Step 1. Ultimate power plan settings. At first click on the search box and type command. After that right click on command prompt in the elevated search result and choose run as administrator. Command prompt with administrative rights will be opened. Now, to initialize a new ultimate power mode, execute this command by copy pasting in CMD window and hitting enter. Once you have executed the command, close the command prompt window. Now, let's choose this power plan created and select it and tweak it also. Press Windows key plus R to open a run terminal. In run window, type or copy paste powerc.cpl and then press enter. In the power options window, choose ultimate performance. Now, click on change plan settings to edit the power plan settings. In edit plan settings window, set turn off the display to never. Now, set put the computer to sleep to never. If you are using a laptop, you may notice additional settings on battery in the same window. Whatever settings you are applying to plug it in, settings, do the same for the on battery parameter also. Click on change advanced power settings. Now, we are going to tweak a few settings in the power options window. In the power options window, click on hard disk to expand it. Again click on turn off hard disk after to expand it and then set the settings minutes to zero. Same way, expand another parameter desktop background settings, and then expand slideshow. Now, change the settings, to paused. Now, expand wireless adapter settings. Again expand power saving mode and then set the settings to maximum performance. Now, expand PCI Express and then expand link state power management. Tweak the settings to off. Then, expand processor power management and then expand minimum processor state. Set settings, to 100 to squeeze the highest performance out of it. Now, expand system cooling policy and set it to active. Same way, expand maximum processor state and then settings percent to 100. In the power options window, expand display and then expand turn off display after. Set the settings minutes parameter to zero. Finally, after changing all the settings, click on apply and OK to save the changes on your computer. Coming back to edit plan settings window, Click on Save Changes to save the changes on your computer. Step 2. Disable Startup Items. Disabling the startup of unnecessary applications on your computer will reduce the booting time, affecting the overall system performance significantly. Open the Task Manager window. In Task Manager, go to the Startup tab. Now, right-click on any unnecessary startup item and then click on Disable to disable it. Now, repeat the same feat for any unnecessary startup items in the Task Manager window. Once you have disabled all unnecessary tasks, close the task manager window. This process will decrease the booting time significantly. Step 3. Set the page to file settings. You can use unused disk space as virtual memory for your system. Press Windows key plus R to open run window on your computer. In run window, type season.cpl and then hit enter to open system properties. In system properties window, go to the advanced tab. Under the Performance tab, click on Settings. Now, go to the Visual Effects tab. Check both of these options show thumbnail instead of icons in the options smooth edge of screen fonts. In the Performance Options window, go to the Advanced tab. Now, in the option Adjust for Best Performance of Settings to Program. Now, under the Virtual Memory section, click on Change to Change Page to File Size Change. In the Virtual Memory window, uncheck the option Automatically Manage Paging File Size for All Drives. Now, you can decide any storage option to utilize as paged file resources. If you decide to free your Windows drive of paging files to increase the performance, go for these steps. Select C, Drive. Click on No Paging Size. Click on Set to set it. If you see a warning message, click on Yes to confirm the change. Click on OK when you have done setting page files. In the Performance Options window, click on Apply and then click on OK to save the changes. Finally, click on Apply and then on OK to save the changes on your computer. Now you have successfully increased the virtual RAM of your system. Step 4. Use graphics specifics for high performance in games. 
Click on Start Menu and select Settings. Click on Gaming to open Gaming Settings. Now, under Related Settings, click on Graphics Settings to open Graphics Settings. Now, click on Browse. Now, go to the file location where the game is installed on your computer, select the AZ file and then click on Add. In this video, I have selected Fortnite client file on my computer. Now, in the Graphics Settings window, you will be able to see the game you have selected. Click on the game and then click on Options. In Graphics Specifications panel, click on High Performance. Click on Save to save the settings, and then Close Settings window. Step 5. Use Quick CPU. Use Quick CPU to get the most performance out of the CPUs on your computer. Link download Quick CPU in the description. In Quick CPU window, set the Core Parking Index to 100%. Set Turbo Boost Index to 100%. And frequency scaling index to 100%, and frequency scaling index to 100%. Finally, click on apply to apply the settings on your computer. 